All right, uh, so this is Grandpa's 30 thoughts. And so we asked him 30 questions, and he's got 30 answers. So what's your favorite uh, food and your favorite beverage? Uh, the beverage would be uh, Mountain Dew okay. and coffee. And the food in the morning would be a sweet roll. Okay, so what's your favorite memory? Jumping off the barn roof onto a snowbank. That's how deep the snow was. <laughs> I don't know. You don't have a favorite car? One that you've always wanted to drive, maybe, or work on, whatever? No. Any favorite kind of, uh, what do you want to call it, a model? Yeah, and then Chevrolet. Chevrolet? Yeah, but Ford's used to be there, too. Oh, yeah? What is your least favorite car, then? One that had four wheels. What? Did you say one that had four wheels? Okay. I don't know. How the hell would I know? <laughs> well, you know, there's all the different kinds of vehicles around. I know, but you're talking about the wrong stuff here. Yeah. Yeah, but isn't there one that you just like? Or not like? No. No? There's cars, some of them I don't like, but oh. I gotta think of what that is. Yeah. Want me to pause it? Yeah, I ain't gonna, you ain't gonna get shit. <laughs> What's one thing you wish you could change out of your whole life? I should have stayed in oil patch way back in the 70s. That would have helped me a bunch. How would it help you? Because I'd have been, I knew what was going okay. on. What's your favorite gun to shoot and your favorite round to shoot? My favorite gun is a Weatherby Mark V that I built, and the caliber is 300 Weatherby Magnum. Okay. Were you younger? Yep. What did you do for fun when you were younger? We usually went either horseback riding or, or went for a ride on the motorcycles with the friends. Oh, yeah? You did that on the weekends? Weekend, yeah. Saturday, uh, not too many Saturdays, but yeah. Sundays. After all the chores were done, I yep. suppose. <laughs> okay. How did you know you wanted to be a mechanic and why? Because I always had to fix the motorcycles when they broke down, or we didn't get to have any fun on Sunday. Oh, yeah. <laughs> that makes sense. <laughs> so, what's your dream job and why? My dream job is being able to tell somebody to do something. And it gets done. And when you get to over there and you get to working on it, and they are actually working on it, getting it done. And by the time you turn around, you have to reconvince yourself that you're not finishing the job. Okay. If you could travel anywhere in the world, where would you want to travel? I think I'd want to go to Mexico. I'd like to see how bad it is down there, why they're all trying to get in here. <laughs> what would your advice be for the next generation? You gotta get these kids to get out of bed, go get a job because uh, nobody's working. What's the worst thing you've got in trouble for, Grandpa? I'm killing a chicken and Ma made me go butchering. Alright, what is your biggest regret? I should have kept going and went to college when I had the chance. All right, your, your greatest achievements. Greatest achievements would probably be just being a good mechanic. Okay, what, what's the most rewarding thing about getting older? Absolutely nothing. <laughs> what kind of things make you happiest now? Just get out of the house and go do something. Where, what places have you been to? Well, I've been to California, I've been to Virginia. Kind of stayed a little bit more closer to home. All right, what do you think the greatest invention is? Well, the cell phone and TV. Probably the longest polling items out. Okay, what jobs did you have before Sego Electric? I did a little oil field. Did some agriculture, working for Kessels, working for AgriPower. And then I went on my own. How did you meet your spouse? 
or Patty? We were down in Medora eating a meal, Little Missouri. What's the most important life lesson you've learned? I learned what I like, and the best thing is to stay with what you've learned. All right, what's your favorite uh, fashion trend? Dickie's pants, where you can go out and get them dirty and then wash up clean. All right, which do you prefer, city life or country life, and why? I prefer country life, because it's quieter. Best advice you receive from someone? Yeah, if you get knocked down, get back up and keep on going. What is your biggest disadvantage? Money. Money? Okay, what's the thing you value most in life? Family. Family? Family, okay. Okay, what does it take to be happy? Just a, just a family. Just a family and friends? Yeah. How do you bounce back after hard times? Just get back up and get going. Just keep going. Nobody's going to help you, right? No. Nope. No. Nope. If you had all the money in the world, what would you buy? I wouldn't need to buy anything because I'd have it all. But I'd like to build a racetrack between Seattle and Brainerd. Gotcha. Thank you for all the donated items and thank you for coming. My grandpa really appreciates it. And doing this 30 thoughts, let me, yeah, I mean, even, even now I know a lot more about my grandpa and I, hopefully, hopefully you guys do too. Thank you.